You know, since you brought up the targeted therapy, uh, maybe we can come back to the stage four patient. How do you decide? So you your first line, it sounds to me your first line of treatment is immunotherapy, right? And what uh, do, what is, how do you use the targeted therapy for a stage four patient? Is there even a room to use those therapy? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I think there's still a very important role for the 40 to 50% of ERAF melanomas. <clears throat> um, you know, we, we know a few things. One, there was a, a big um, trial just completed and reported out this year and published this year called the DreamSeq trial that actually looked at that sequencing question, right? Is it better to do immunotherapy first or is it better to do targeted therapy first? It was very clear that um, outcomes are gonna be better if we do immunotherapy um, and then switch to targeted therapy later if we need it. Um, again, there, you know, I think there are gonna be select cases where I think there might be a role for um, targeted therapy first for various reasons and then maybe switching to immunotherapy, but in general, immunotherapy and then targeted therapy. Um, you know, and, and again, for the BRAF mutant melanoma cases, we, we have that option. Um, it's it's different for the patients whose tumors don't have a BRAF mutation. Sure. They're, they're, they're missing that, that yeah. important kind of treatment, um, you know, option. So that's, that's an issue. 